Hey guys, welcome to my completely unscripted unboxing. I just came home from work and I got a new package, so I just thought I would share with you guys. So here's what I got in the mail. Cute World of Final Fantasy Static Arts Minis. So they're supposed to be um, a small tiny little statue from their Static Arts line from Square Enix. So these characters, Tama and the Choker Chick, are both from World of Final Fantasy. I ordered these statues like last year sometime at the end of the year and they finally arrived. It's April but it's not too late because they're still freaking adorable. So the top we have World of Final Fantasy. The side it shows you all the um, different statues you can get from the series. I only got number one and number two which is Tama and the Choco Chick. If you compare the image from the Choco Chick box, um, Tama looks a lot greener. The actual Tama looks actually really green and dark, so um, I wonder what it's going to look like when I open it. And the same with Choco Chick here, he's looking really, really orange, even though in the picture over here, he looks more yellow. You see that? Let's open them up and take a look. So, opening Tama up in a standard blister packaging. Looks like she has a very normal white stand that she stands on. There's no tape around the blister packaging. Pops right off. Super easy. Oh my god, she's so cute! She's really adorable. Yay! She is roughly four and a half inches tall, which is not bad. $35. I mean, it's pretty pricey for $35, but. I mean, come on, look at how cute it is. So I'm kind, of, I'm kind of sad that the only characters they have for this series is Tama, Choco Chick, the Catcher Conductor, and the Magitek Ormer because there's like a lot of really cute monsters in this game. There's like, you know, the baby Shivas, Ifrit. I would really love a baby Bahamut one. That is, that would be so cute. So I'm taking Choco Chick out and he is also in standard blister packaging. Looks like there's also no tape on this one. Bam! Slides right off. He also has a white base like Tama. Oh, there's like a little speckle of black right here that's unexpected. The quality of these aren't bad. Surprisingly, the Choco Chick feels a little bit heavier than Tama. You can also see there's like a paint chip right here. There's also a scratch right here on the tail. I don't know if you can see that paint smudge right here. So the quality of these aren't the best, but they are like $35, which I know it's not cheap, but it's cheap for statues. Choco Chick actually looks a lot fatter. Roughly three and a half, maybe four inches tall. And... It looks super duper cute. Hi! <laughs> Close up of Tama. And that's it. Thank you so much for joining me today. Hi, Barley. Um, it's just my really quick impromptu unboxing. Let me know if you want to see more of this kind of content. And I'll do more of them. Thank you so much. I'll see you all next time.